Hi everyone, I'm Le. And nowadays, the energy problem has become more and more important. We have been told for many years that our oil and gas have been used up very soon. So what should we do? But unfortunately, we recently found fact there are a lot of oil and gas still in the deep layer of rock. So, but uh, this uh, uh, deep layer of rock is very difficult because it's not easy to dry the oil and the gas out. So what we can do? That's the uh, emergency is uh, to dissolve the rock. So what is the dissolution? Imagine that you put the hot water into the sugar the sugar will dissolve, they just disappeared. So, if we, the same process is that if we inject a reactive liquid to the rock, the rock will be dissolved. So, but uh, instead means if we have a very high injection rate and a high pressure, that means we will get more oil and gas out, the answer is no, because there is, there is a maximum, and uh, we will we should find the optimal injection rate to that. But uh, how to do that is to understand the physics under the dissolution. So that is my topic. My topic is uh, is to is focus on the dissolution process. So we should study like uh, in, uh, experiments like inject water into the plaster. It will give a simulation to the uh, field, field, like uh, we inject the reactive fluid into the rock. And to understand the how the dissolution pattern forms, it will give us the knowledge of uh, how to dissolve in the rock. So it will be very useful both in the oil industry application and also in the lots of process of geophysics. So, so that is my uh, research. Thank you very much.